My name is Mahmoud Hanai. I'm going to talk about the ultra-efficient solar technology. I'm going to talk about the scalability of this technology, the CBV, comparing to the normal solar technology. This technology can be de deployed in different kind of applications. Utility applications, commercial and industrial, uh, government and uh, military applications. In the utility, utility applications, the CBV power technology is ideally preferred for the large scale generations. In industrial and commercial applications, the CBV technology support and provide the most efficient power resources. It supports both large and small industries. Actually, our group um, aims to produce um, a new product of CBVs uh, with uh, good quality uh, for the customers in an actually high uh, reliability. Of course, CBVs can provide a good quality based on uh, high reliable standards on designing. The key, feature, the key design features includes steel, glass and silicon constructions. Unique optics ensure uniform microcell heating. Microcells operate at low temperature and uh, low uh, currents, minimizing long-term degradation mechanism. Microcells connected with robust thin film interconnects. Internal wiring, highly turbulent of uh, microcell failure. Well, the world's smallest most ultra-efficient technology of the solar cell can produce 50% more of power energy rather from a normal traditional silicon-based solar cell. It can also have a higher efficiency up to 35%, which is two to three times more than a normal solar cell. And it can also produce 300 watts per meter square. Performance during high temperatures drops down when uh, solar energies are used but with the ultra efficient technology the, the the cells can work and perform even in higher temperatures and they have used three to four multi-junctions in the cells so that they can even release the heat that has been consumed so they can work in very high temperature areas like deserts Ultra-efficient technology can provide consistent power not only during the peak hours of the day, but from the morning to the afternoon. And this is unlike the normal silicon-based solar cells that only produce higher energy during the peak time. This can benefit all the utilities that can work to the afternoon. The key advantages of CBV technologies. First one, high efficiency. Wood record models efficiencies up to 35.5 percent two to three greater efficiency than competing bv technology second the high performance industry leading high temperature performance third low cost in dry sunny climates capable of delivering the lowest cost of, of electricity of all bv technologies fourth one consistent daily energy production by tracking the sun generates very consistent energy production close to rated power throughout the day. The fifth point, which is the last key advantage, is high energy density. Traditional photovoltaic cells use silicon to convert solar energy into electrical power. A concentrated photovoltaic cell converts uh, concentrated solar energy into electrical power. How it does that is really simple by using a concentrated uh, photocell to convert concentrated solar energy into electricity. According to proven research, it is uh, noted that the uh, amount of semiconductor needed is cut down by 1,100 times, which means that you can have a limited amount of semiconductors and generate uh, at least 35.5% more power. And this reduces the real estate value a lot because um, we can use less space and generate more power. It's very flexible, highly reliable, and is entirely scalable, which means that it's a perfect solution 
for people who are looking for a very good uh, consistent power generation as well as very high profit in terms of uh, electric value.